Welcome back. The holiday season is the time to eat, drink, and be merry. But unfortunately, that's not an option for everyone. In fact, right now, more than 25,000 children living in Douglas County are living in hunger. So joining us now with information on how you can help shine a light on hunger is Leanne Day with the Conagra Foundation. Good morning. Hello, Chen. Thank you for having me here today. Yes, well, we're so excited. Tell us about what you've brought here and teach us a little bit about this fun recipe. Yeah, we're going to do some fun recipe here. So pancakes are a favorite weekend breakfast in our house. Absolutely. But today we're going to do something a little more fun. We're going to turn your basic round pancakes into a festive Santa and snowman with just some ready whip some berries, chocolate morsels, and pretzels. Okay, looks delicious. So for a snowman, you want three little pancakes. Okay. But for Santa, you're gonna want one big guy. Yeah. And I've made his hat here with raspberries. Strawberries would also be a good option here. Okay. I'm gonna finish off his hat here with a little Ooh, palm. you're fancy, okay. And then most important here, we need a nice big beard. A nice big ready yes. beard, yep. So, Ooh, you're a pro at this. Mr. Santa. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so now you can go ahead oh. and cover our snowman no here. Okay. I've decided it's going to be a very fluffy snowman. Yes, fluffy is great. This. Is this too much? Is it's there your, such a thing? It's your snowman. I don't think okay. he can go too much. Okay, look at this. He's, he's very <laughs> snow he's good. covered. Good. So, yes, we talk about, you know, 25,000 children about, just yeah. in Douglas County experience hunger. And you know, this is a, a, a fun family recipe, but hunger affects even more than that every age, every age. Absolutely, and I know this campaign obviously very important and it's been going on for such a long time. Tell us how can people get involved? Yes, you can get involved many ways. You can donate food throughout the metro. There's many um, locations set up. You can uh, go ice skating downtown, 10th and Capitol. Um, a portion of your skate rental will go directly to the food bank of the Heartland. And, um, or else you can even donate directly to the food bank of the Heartland. Um, there's more information online, on, details on each of those at holidaylightsfestival.org. Now the goal, the ConAgra Barons Foundation of this campaign is to raise the equivalent of 1.5 million meals for the Food Bank of the Heartland. So if you can go participate in any of those ways, you're going to be contributing to that. Absolutely. Now before we wrap up, tell us what are some items the Food Bank really needs right now if people were to drop off yes. some items. So protein. Protein is what they really need most. So peanut butter, canned chicken, canned tuna, you know, cereal, and macaroni and cheese are also the top of that list of their needs. All right. Thank you so much, yes. Leanne, for joining thank us you. and teaching us this simple but delicious <laughs> recipe. Yes, thank you.